Secretary of State's office is investigating the owner of a mobile home community in Clackamas County for possible voter intimidation. Fox News' Marilyn Deutsch joins us now from the Clackamas County Elections Office with a story. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, this involves a small town, Johnson City. It is just north of Gladstone. We're talking about a small housing community in Johnson City. The Secretary of State's office says it has had several requests to investigate Brian Johnson, who owns that housing community there in Johnson City. Johnson is accused of intimidating voters in the community over a ballot measure that would include Johnson City in the Clackamas Library District. The complaint alleges Johnson is threatening renters with a rent hike if the measure passes. Now, one of those renters, Tara Schofstall, actually wrote the argument in favor of the ballot measure and is one of the people who says Johnson is intimidating tenants which says that rent will be a pass-through tax, but does not mention that it's only a dollar, which is why everybody is going, that's why it's, it's intimidation. As you just heard, the rent hike would only be about a dollar, but Schofstall says that wasn't made clear in Johnson's letter. Johnson does have some support, though, within the community from people who say they will be voting no on this measure. I don't need higher taxes on anything. I mean, as, if, as it is, my taxes are already going up in this park. And I don't need them to go up any higher because for a library. Johnson refused to speak with us on camera, but he did show us a letter he sent to the community. He says he doesn't see anything wrong with it. And he says the voters pamphlet itself talks about the possible effect on people's taxes. Reporting live at the Clackamas County Elections Office, Marilyn Deutsch. Good day, Oregon.